Hello guys, it is Denzi and today in this video of me I am going to show the new object which is brought to us by the very newest DLC called Get Together and I'm both showing the build mode objects as well as the buy mode objects you guys can see them uh, they mainly added so many um, hobby objects such as this uh, fun bringing objects and DJing some new dancing platforms and they added much much decorative objects as well as one new fireplace you guys can see and this is a mini bakery and cafe station it is it's just quite cozy there are so many cafes you guys can build or get in together and these are these are the roof decorations you guys can see as well as um, I am showing that there are some colorful pools they brought some new colors to the pool like four or something much more look, making look like pond on a little bit more unclean stuff but, but it's quite natural and they added so many living room pets and so many chairs and desks you guys can see also there are some outdoor um, furniture besides furniture it is like just uh, environmental stuff like foundations sorry fountains columns um, <laughs> my boyfriend is laughing at me because of foundations <laughs> Um, and also there are so many new wall paintings which is holding, I'm sorry, carrying the inspiration from one of the Sims 2 towns which was called... I, I don't remember what it was called but if anybody played it you guys gotta know what I'm saying just like these wall paintings we have seen there and some sort of realistic looking items uh, they all was also almost all was also in one of the Sims 2 towns, which was a base base game town, nothing special. Um, and also there are some runes, as you guys can see. Um, so I don't really think you guys can put those things in your house or in some sort of, but they are really cool if you're gonna make a park, maybe like some rune park. And this little tiny tiny bit roof there. You guys can see it is perfect for modern houses in my opinion because it is uh, removing all the emptiness on the roof if it's a flat roof you know and they added so many doors and um, they all um, look cool but they are not all functional uh, when it comes to the first level wall doors as you guys can see they're a little bit short I, I don't really like those short doors at the entrance like front doors so um, i had struggled a little bit to fit in those big windows as you guys could see they these big windows and a tiny tiny little bit of a door as if it's like the entrance so um, they could add some like a more wooden style, those gothic stylish, but still a little bit more bigger door. But they added so many modern doors, yeah, that's cool. And also they added those wall vines, that's something was super interesting about this DLC. And if, if I have to talk about the Creative Sim news, um, they are quite satisfying which is there are so many types of clothes they brought to the female both male um, but male is a little bit less than the female clothes they brought some eccentric and marginal stuff for female as well as there are so many classic and cute looking ones I, I really enjoyed it and also they added so many hairstyles but they didn't really touch um, any more like accessory base. There wasn't much accessory based stuff. Nope. Um, but all those clothes and hairstyles were enough for us. I mean, because they added so many other objects and, and features in the game too. With a whole massive town, which is the best so far I have seen. Um, and they added few tops. 
but they all look perfect that those tops were needed in my opinion and not many pants or anything for males sadly but well, I, I like this DLC, first of all, when I watched the first trailers and stuff like that, I thought it's just gonna be very plain and not many features in it, not satisfying, but after I fucking seen it, <laughs> sorry for the bad words, I actually like it so much, it is so interesting, super cool, I suggest it, say hey, everybody, if you guys are interested in a DLC, this is cool. This is really cool. If we compare the get to work one. Well, of course, that was good on its own ways. This is good on its own ways, but this thing is a little bit more functional, in my opinion. Well, of course, it's all up to you guys. And I have to say that thanks for watching me. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If so, you guys can show it to me with likes or subscribe. See ya!